All right. This poem is what you are going to be reading today. Remember, you can listen to it if you go on to Schoology and use this link. Then log in. And then it will pop up and you'll just have to make sure you switch to poem number five since that's the unit we're on and then you can listen to it um, if you'd rather that. I know poetry is not always the easiest thing to understand, but the only way we can get better at it is by practicing. So read it, listen to it, read it again, listen to it again, and just do your best to understand what it is asking. The questions you're gonna have to respond to is who is the narrator of this poem? When they say we, who is talking? Because it starts out, we were taken from the ore bed and the mine, so from the earth. We were melted in the furnace and the pit. We were cast and wrought and hammered to design. We were cut and filed and tooled and gauged to fit. So who is that we that is talking? It says here, we will serve you four and 20 hours a day, so all day long. We can pull and haul and push and lift and drive. Who is talking? Um, so you're gonna have to make some inferences because it's not necessarily obvious, but I think if you really think, okay, what makes sense that would be saying that? All right, and I'll give you a clue. It's not necessarily a human that's uh, narrating this. The second thing is, do you agree that machines are greater than the peoples or the kings? Because in the last paragraph, it says, we are not built to comprehend a lie, so we don't understand lies. We can neither love nor pity nor forgive, so like we don't have emotion. If you make a slip in handling us, you die. We are greater than the peoples or the kings. Be humble as you crawl beneath the rods. So are machines greater than humans, essentially, right? Like we use machines for so many things we do. So are we sort of in, are we in control? Or if, if you think about it, are machines sort of in control of the lives we're living? Are machines greater than humans? And there's not a wrong answer, depending on how you think about it. Just make sure to explain what you're thinking and why you might think, hmm, I think, you know what, machines are greater because da da da. Or nope, I think people are greater because da da da. All right? And just make sure you're explaining, you're really thinking, because um, poetry can be so cool. So don't be scared by it. Um, ask for help if you need it. And just remember to do your best. Good luck.